the new acunit.com studios. This is the Big Red Radio, 98 KUPD, Tempe, Phoenix. It is the Big Red Radio, 98 KUPD. Larry McFeely in the studio with Mr. Corey Taylor and Josh Rand. And, of course, you know what? We've also got uh, John Holmberg in the studio as well. It's very nice to have him in here because... uh, you know, if he wasn't in here, it would just be a lot of you mad at me. Well, he's just, well, I mean, he's a huge fan of Josh Rand, who's also here. Josh Rand, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Stone Sour. Thank you. Thank Which, you actually, here. Josh is like the oldest. What? Bestest member of this band. I mean, he's really hung through, through everything. I love how you're his just staying kind of pepper. Well, right. some I'm weird to innuendo. Well, that, first off, well, no, I'm uncomfortable. I'm, not, I'm uncomfortable. Right hang now. on a second. It's the staying power. It's the first staying is, power of I Josh. I am definitely not the oldest person in this. Easy, band. easy. Because <laughs> I'm not either. I don't want that getting yeah. out there. I believe the phrase Larry used was most most hung bestest band. What? Most bestest. Oh, hung. you're the hung the word hung. The hung. You're the one that. Yeah. Let's let's get yeah. back to the hung the hung jury because the jury's out on that. All right. People don't know. Has there been There's no photographic proof. Has there been a contest in the band? You don't need to know that. That's a lot. <laughs> oh, you lost. Corey lost. That's not you the point. Be, you wouldn't the be so defensive. Is, it was cold in that room. <laughs> <laughs> if you didn't. And Josh is quiet. I so didn't Josh get a chance is, to warm up. Josh if you was couldn't tell two. by all the yelling, yeah. uh, Corey Taylor is here, and <laughs> so is Josh you know Ramp from Stone <laughs> Sour. All right, the Just new album is coming out. you're one of my favorite people doesn't mean I won't smack the crap out of you. Try. I will. God, well, I will. Oh, so try. Like you, got a, you got a long way to go here. <laughs> hey, speaking like, of hey, smacking the crap small, out of people, but I'm wiry. we, we got to talk, talk about, about this. anything other than you today. Well, yeah. I mean, yeah. We're not talking album. about me. We're going to talk right. about uh, that guy, Chad Kroger. Canadian. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, boy. What's with this thing? Okay. Like, what's going so here, on? Here's the deal. I, I was sitting story. there trying to figure out how I was going to handle this, uh-huh. right? Because it's so funny. Just recap like, how, like, recap what you know of it, Corey. From your side of like things. From your, like, oh, dude, it's hilarious. So happened. apparently he just was, like, a little drunk. Yep. Just started going. Like, he snapped on Stone Sour, dude. Yep. Like, not only Stone Sour, but Slipknot, which, yeah. dude, you're an idiot. You don't snap on that. Yo, dude, he called you Nickelback Light. Yeah, Stone which, is, which is pretty funny. And then said, uh, you said that at one point, you said bad things about him and said, uh, it's easy to write a hit song, and he said, "So then, go ahead and write." I, you know what? I've never said it was easy to write yeah, a hit song. Well, I don't know said. what the hell planet he's living on. <laughs> Apparently, it's Planet Kroger because it's, it's there must be good weed there because yeah. he's an idiot. In all oh, honesty, in okay. all honesty, here's the thing. What, no, I no. was so queued up to say some stuff about him, and then I just started reading all the comments yeah. online. Damn. I don't have to say a damn thing. Yeah. Right? He is not a liked person. Yeah, but that's, that's all we have to say about it. That's no. interesting, though, because, you know, social media is, like, such a big deal now. And anything that happens on social media, people know about it immediately. Like, mm-hmm. what if social media folks said that they didn't like the new Hydrograd album? I don't care. There you go. And? That's what I wanted to hear. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. And he's so worried about that. No wonder he's where he at? he's at. It's because you're so worried about people like, who gives a... God, you're so lucky Most I can't swear right now. Close. Ugh, I got, you got, a, me, I got, you got me on the seven I got a seconds. button in case you do. Yeah, <laughs> here's my, here's my worry. Do. They, they've had me here before. They oh, yeah. so, Corey, if this gets into a point where it's like, all right, it gets to fighting words and then you two run into each other and yeah. stuff, the danger of this is, and with social media it would be filmed, what? is that maybe Chad's been training and that's why he's got a big mouth now. He's definitely he's definitely pulling bottles to his mouth. <laughs> he's got the those are that's why he's, got, those, he's got the that's he's got curls. the brew curls. Going that's right. On. But the bad news is, if you get beat up by Nickelback, you can't outlive that's true. that. You that's cannot true. outlive that's true. A, a beating from. Nickelback. I want you to look at my face. Are you worried? This is me worried. Okay, that's you scared of it. That's a good luck. That's a good <laughs> Let's luck just say, because it would look, be Uncle Uncle FM is not losing any goddamn sleep about <laughs> Chad Kroger's hate. <laughs> Is there a possibility that any of this is a promotional machine? Duh! Larry's that's fan. why I'm not. That's yeah. why I didn't want to talk about it. I was just like, you want to sell no, poetry? No, no. You. You're Shut supposed your to mouth, say, yeah. yeah, you're supposed to say no, not at all. And I hate that Chad Kroger. And his new album sucks. That. And yeah, I would his say, his new album, blah blah blah, which comes out at this day. <laughs> I hate it too. <laughs> By the way, the new Hydrograd album comes out June totally, 30th. Totally, dude. Set. Like, that's what every one of those goddamn clickbait stories is. It's like, oh, by the way, Hydrograd coming out June 30th, blah, blah, blah. It's just like, dude, shove that straight up your ass. But would, what would you say to him if he was sitting here right now? He'd be like, look, first off, you need a sponsor. Hey, well, hey, here's yeah. the thing. Yeah. Is that this is what I would that? say. I was like, y- you can run your mouth all you want. All I know is I've been voted sexiest dude in rock wearing a mask. You've been voted ugliest dude in rock twice yeah. without one. 
and stick that up your ass. Oh, and by wow. the way, oh, and by the way, <laughs> congratulations to Corey Taylor and Stone Sour because they have another number one hit today. Yeah, oh, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Today, Who right? Can't write another, another one. Oh. Right. Another one. And the answer is, if, if he ever said to you, "Hey, buddy, why don't you write a hit song?" You'd say, "Why don't you write a rock song?" There's Are there, is there any Nickelback that you actually like? No. Come on. <laughs> Just a one. one. How you remind no, me. I, here's the thing. I love, you I love <laughs> all the dudes in that band. Yeah. I love Mike. I love all like everybody else in that band. I'm very, very cool with. I've hung out with them. Mm-hmm. It's just a uh, face like a foot who I can't oh, really hang nice. out with. You know? Face like a foot. I He's like got a that. face like a foot. Am I yeah. wrong? No, 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 no. That's no, great. No. Josh, you're really quiet about this. Uh, <laughs> who would you like to fight, Josh? <laughs> <laughs> let's, start who's, a, let's start a war. Who's yeah, let's Why Josh. the hell did yeah. we come here? Yeah. Josh, let's start who's Canada's biggest dick? <laughs> this is fucking... Oh, did you catch There's it? I, I, got it. I 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 got it. I'm good what over here. Think? See, it wasn't me today. I'm on top of it. All right? It's Potty Mouth over here. It's all right. I can't take you anywhere. And don't forget, uh, you can catch Potty Mouth later today over at Zia Records. Almost still in the alley at 6 o'clock. They're going to be uh, pre-selling yeah. albums and uh, <laughs> signing stuff. Stay on target. All we're doing right now is creating... Like like more hate news feeds for oh. Loudwire and good. alternative yeah, press. That's great for us. So that, is that good promo- for you? This promotion you sure? machine can be like yes. good for us because <laughs> it'll be you like are Josh Rand was on ninety eight KUPD yeah. earlier this afternoon when he said he was going to kill F Canada. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody he said go F Canada. Only yeah. thing he said the entire oh. Radio. <laughs> Whoa. You are trying to get me killed. Both Whoa. of you at twice. <laughs> we got a tour there. Yeah, no, I know. You'll be fine. All right, let's. You let's, got open for Nickelback, right? Let's talk about sure. song number three. Let's well, talk about song actually, number three. I just have to throw this out please, here. Please, please. It is funny. Yes. They did want us to open. What? A couple months ago through yeah. Canada. Yeah. No really? kidding. Yes. Yeah. The, your label or the band? The band. The band. They really did. And how did that How did that they conversation asked us and We declined. We, yeah. <laughs> We did not acquiesce to the request. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Maybe that's why uh, there's oh, some, some attitude going on. Yeah. Well, you know Wouldn't what? you like to I go up there? I remember my first crush, too. <laughs> to, 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 like, blow him off stage night after night? Wouldn't it give you a little extra motivation? No. <laughs> no? Not at <laughs> all. We've been doing that for years. I know, but, like, <laughs> like back to back. Just one more oh, band. Yeah. That's true. That's, but, see, that's the hard thing. Like, I can't even say anything about the band, Nickelback, because it's like, like none of them have an issue with us. Right. It's him. Right. So, dude, curl and you up guys in bed did? with your Hello Kitty pillow sure, you shut up. Both joined Roadrunner at the same time and all that kind of garbage, and they like to say, oh, well, you know, we paved the way for you. Well. Agree to disagree. Really, I will totally disagree. Agree to that. disagree. Yeah. Josh, you were in the middle of saying something. I don't want to step I, all I over you. Let's just say he was gonna kill Roadrunner took all the Slipknot money and gave it to Nickelback to sign them. Mm. Oh. oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I like these this stories. Great. Keep going, please. Who That's else? All I'm going to say about. Let's hear, let's hear some We've more. We've already given Loudwire too much. Yeah. Like, all right. I'm, I'm, all right. I'm officially bummed out now. All right. This what is more the... than I said I was going to say, and I blame you, McFeel. Hey. Well, then you're going to blame me a little more. What'd you do for Dad's Day? <laughs> well, my kids. Well, half my kids called me. What? Well, son good. forgot. Like, <laughs> just because that's because what that's what boys do. Um, did you get anything? Did, did you get anything? I got some flowers and some candy. Awesome. It was cool. You good. know, uh, but it was a very. It was a very general, it was from your family. Right. Like, it was a very general card, and I was like, well, okay. From no one signed huh? it individually? No. Just no. your family? It was just it was stamped? Couple. Was it at least written? No, it was stamped. It, it was, was a stamp. It was through a service. <laughs> it was cool, you know, I, I felt good about it. Was there any, like, arts and crafts in there, anything? That no, but there was some s'mores. Oh, there you go. There you s'mores. Go. Oh, dude, it was full of junk. Like, yeah. how old yeah. am I, 12? Like, dude, yeah. is priest, man. Yeah, but everybody yeah. loves s'mores, so it's not a bad look, I didn't say, I'm not trying yeah. to, look, are you trying to start beef with the s'mores people with me? <laughs> right. I, you are inferring things, sir, and I'm Chad not Kruger comfortable said the it. s'mores would get you going. That's I yeah. knew that was a big issue. It's a hot one. What is your, what is Corey's perfect weekend? Josh. Oh, wow. Wow, That's you know, was perfect weekend? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go, let's go. I mean, is it actually playing a show, or is it relaxing? Or is it you actually know, and I just, you know, we're snuggled up on the couch. Yeah. Oh, that's so sweet. Watching football. Wow. As you do. That's you know, cute. Getting ready for the show. Rooting against the yeah. Cardinals. Is Roy a part of that? Oh, oh you soon. son of a. Too soon? Look at my hands. Is Roy a part of that, too, or is it just you and Josh? Roy's uh, cooking, usually. I mean, it's cooking. usually Roy, you know, grilling out. No, he's spreading out. He's spreading out. out. <laughs> he does. He, spre- he does take up a room. I heard that uh, Roy was the one that came up with the idea for song number three. With the uh, video. Is that what you heard? With the video. 
Oh, that would be fabulous. No the video for fabulous. Oh, okay. It's so, really so who did song number three then? Because it's awesome. That was my idea. Well, for the most. I mean, part, it yeah. sucked. I mean, it was not. Come that on, good. man. It was, it was kind of okay. And, you. Uh, you know, when it was Roy's idea, but it was, was no fabulous, but it was good. <laughs> <laughs> it's <was> okay. <laughs> song number three is now song number one as of this morning. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. That's on the right. charts, so, number one. You know, it, uh, uh, once again, proving Chad's theory that I don't know how to write a hit song. Does you, that matter to you? What the, right, the what? charts? Did it, yeah, that it went up on the charts. It's I know, cool. I know it's a big deal because it's, it's cool. It's, yeah. I mean, you 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 hope for it, but you don't yeah. you don't write a song thinking oh it's going to be a hit. You write a song because it's cool, right? You write a song because you want to hear it. So his whole theory is shot. Yeah. You know, all he does is sit there and count his beans and his nickels. <laughs> Nickel and... beans. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say it. You did. I did. Um, and it's I like a good the band. feeling. I like it's the band a good too. feeling. But that's not why you write music. You write music so hopefully people will feel the same kind of emotion that you feel about it, you know? If it's catchy, it's catchy. If it's not, it's not. It doesn't mean it's good or bad. It doesn't matter. So, And 15 songs made it on this album, correct? Yeah. yeah. That's a lot. Yeah. That's a lot. I mean, people are releasing albums now with like seven or eight tracks on it. Well, that's their own fault. It is. How many didn't make it? Four. You got four that are sitting on the yeah, side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Can you use those later or? I should probably let Josh chime in. Go ahead. Right now, well, going, why the hell did I get up? Yeah, I, mean, I, I mean, I want to hear from Josh. <laughs> I mean, it's Chad's fault. This it is. is. <laughs> it is. I, mean, it is. So, I came in here to promote our record. <laughs> talk about the signing I we're going to do later. Talk about football. Well, now. one of my favorite things is uh, Josh combing his head in yeah, the uh, well, song that, number three video. That's pretty good. Well, actually, that was very spontaneous. And the only really? person that knew that I was going to do that was Christian because he yeah. was in the same room. Because they were telling me, they were like, you got to you got to slow this scene down. Do something, and, man. Do yeah, something. you got to do something. Slow it down. And I was just like, I'm going to brush my hair. And or he lack started of. laughing. And he's like, no, you're not going to do it. And then, of course, I did also the... Uh, Shooter McGavin. Shooter, yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. You look gig ready. And then what? you're playing the uh, the stand up keyboard there. The uh, so cool. Strap yeah. rocking yeah. the keytar. Yeah, yeah. There's Keep a very good keytar moment. Yeah. Do you ever get a chance to play that? Uh, there's no way in hell. I no can way in hell. <laughs> you wouldn't be able to do it. I had a hard enough time just trying to fake playing that thing. Well, well you guys look like really TV. happy. Yeah. <laughs> you look really damn happy. You guys watching any TV shows right now? Do you get a chance to watch any TV? No. Not at all. No I shows? Really no American have... Gods or Fargo or any of that stuff? No. I'm, I'm, like, addicted to American Pickers right now. American Pickers? Really? Yeah. All right. That's why? Because they're from Iowa. Such oh, a, is that it? Well, and that's home. why I expect uh, you know to, you to be into the Fargo kind of thing too. I mean, it's got everybody's got I the accents, and the... I don't need to see the show. Oh, oh yes, show, you the do. show is so good. That's and I'm so good. Fargo's one of my favorite movies ever. Ah, the show's yeah. ridiculous. I don't know. I it's it's so few and far between. We actually get to watch TV, man. You a know, movie? Like, you get to go out and see movies ever? I try to. Yeah. What's I mean, the last thing? Guardians two. Tw- Four times. Did you like it? Yeah, love, well, I saw it four times. You well, told I thought me. Maybe, I thought maybe you had to go on, with dog. your kids. What? Like I fell asleep three times. Oh, hey, four times trust a charm. Me, I've seen plenty of movies over and over again that I did not like. We have to uh, see this. Wonder again? Woman. I saw was actually really, really good. Yeah, it was I okay. Loved that movie. I think yeah. Chris Pine kind of uh, saved it a little bit. What are you talking about? You watch you watch the Chris Pine Gal 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 Gal. right next to him. He <laughs> uh, just told me everything I need to uh, know. Uh, it's no, fine. No, no, it's all good. No, no, we're all set here. No, I think that uh, she kind of blew it in a few areas. I, I wish. did. I, I wish did. that was true. Okay, she kind of blew what? Chris I'm just Pine. Saying, that is not I haven't what we're seen it yet. Go for I haven't here. seen it. You just sold Rain two tickets. It in. Thank you, you. Sold tickets, Thank my you. friend. See, I'm selling tickets. I'm selling albums here. Hydrograd. You have to be. You have to like have a PhD in water to be a hydrograd. But technically, if you break it down, it means uh, water town in oh. Russian. Really? No. God, yeah, no. You, you fell solid. for that well, so I, quick. Well, you know how gullible I am, for God's <laughs> sake. Funny thing, though. Hydrograd, Watertown. Watertown was actually the, the code name for Area 51. What? That's probably not true. Don't fall for it so fast. Oh, Look wait. Yeah, you know it's what? Totally yeah. I mean, you're so <laughs> full totally of it, Corey. I, I swear to God, it's totally true. I'm not going to believe a thing that you say. You're full of crap. You got the show. How many shows do you have between now and the one you're here? A lot. You got a ton. So you're traveling all. I don't know. What's, uh, what we're here 30th. on the thirtieth. The thirtieth. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, the, oh the, uh, really? The album day. Yeah. Yeah. Is there anything special about Four album five. release concert day? Yeah, that we were gonna. We, yeah, yeah, we've been telling everybody special. on the other. You're gonna Everyone do something gets really special. I'll probably. Like play, I mean, I'll probably play nude again. So oh. I mean, nobody will be there for the that. Set. Always happens. We it's absolutely special. It's so nice and warm here that I isn't look it impressive. lovely? You know, it's isn't fine. It it's cool. It's the only. This is the only place I do that. Larry wanted to ask you off the air. He was saying we should ask him about global warming since it's 120 of the week he's here, just because he knows that you can go off on some some stuff. <laughs> 
That was Larry's idea. I didn't Apparently, know I, I don't have a foot to stand on seeing as we're being taken out of that. Oh, oh yeah, you're not going to. Yeah, because. But yeah. see, technically, he can't do that. So I don't what? know what the hell he's trying. That's all grandstanding for his stupid bitch. Taking us out of the Paris thing. Yeah. I knew it. Yeah. I knew yeah. it all. Yeah. 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 Larry was you right. Go, go, Larry go. was right. Go. Go. I am not nuts. coming to your, <laughs> your house going. anymore. <laughs> keep going. Stupid. Keep going. Just keep going. Nope. Josh, you want to jump in? Hydrograd coming out yeah. June 30th, <laughs> and uh, we're going to be at Zia Records yeah. later this evening at uh, 6 o'clock. Anything special that you're doing at Zia? Will you take your shirt off? Christian's going to pull it out. Christian's going to pull it out? Yeah. Pull yours out or his? Well, that just stands. We'll see what You'll happens, see. You're going to take your shirt off? His shirt will be off, definitely. Because I know it. I mean, I when the, when the song number three video started, I was like, he's got to take his shirt off. Yeah, there, there it is. is. There it is. There it is. Shut up. I swear you to God, not, when the video started, I was like, I was like, he's got to take his shirt off at some point in this video. Yes, and not once. Twice. Yeah, he took it off two times. That's <laughs> true. That's look, right. I wrote it in as a reason. Okay? Well, we look it's forward to you taking your shirt off on the 30th uh, for everyone at the Mesa Amphitheater. <laughs> <laughs> why, don't, why don't we play song number three, and then we'll come back, yeah, finish it up. <laughs> <laughs> Hydrograd coming out June 30th. This is song number three. It's 98 KUPD. Arizona's Real Rock, 98 KUPD. That's Stone Sour with song number three, and they're talking a bunch of crap about me while the song is on. You got it coming. Of course I do. All right. I know it. It's fine. So you guys are going to be here on the 30th. And actually, tonight, you're going to be over at the Zia Records. It's the uh, Alma School and Elliott location, 6 o'clock. And you'll be signing a bunch of stuff. That's right. Yeah. Pre- well, uh, within reason. Okay. I'm All not right. signing What's... babies again. It gets really weird. What's the worst thing you've had to sign? Well, I can't say it on the air. Come on. Yeah, you can. No. I'll yeah, do, you can. I'll do Grand it. Rapids, Michigan, 1999. Um... Signed a, well, I can't say. It's just a, just uh, pretend like. Uh, no, one of It rhymes okay. with. That would be the worst. It rhymes with mutt hole. Really? You yeah. signed someone's butthole? I was, <laughs> <laughs> what in the world? Yeah. With what? Well, I didn't say I was proud of it. No, you brought it up. We got to go. You with that. brought it up. Did you use the hole as the O in Corey? No, I just that I just kind of I just kind of I didn't even really look. But, like <laughs> he just like, knew. Yeah, it was weird. Who asked it was a that? dude. What? It was a dude. Was it Dom? God damn it. With that. <laughs> Got a tattoo. No, he's got a tattoo. Of, I, yeah. Hey, look, I, I didn't ask any questions. Yeah. You ran right to the tattoo shop. And wow. these signings, what is the question you don't want to hear anymore? At the signings? Yeah, yeah. when somebody comes up and goes, oh, oh I don't know. I, did you, do you, are they going to bring up Cor, or, uh, Chad? They're going to bring up the Nickelback. Oh, yeah, dude, please don't Let's bring cut that, that off. Yeah, right. just don't yeah. bring that up because nobody cares. Bring me Even two... Chad Kroger doesn't yeah, care. He's not you know? in. Yeah. <laughs> no. Done with that. He, he doesn't even remember he said You kind it. of get like, you know, when you're doing a Stone Sour signing, you kind of got like, you know, enough with the well, Slipknot guys. I, okay, I, talk listen, about I used to get a little, it used to be kind of like, yeah, I get it. Slipknot and blah, 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 blah. But I can't turn my back on that, you right. know? Like, that would be like me. It'd be so hypocritical of me to say that I'm not proud of what I do with Slipknot, you know? So... You just you're gracious, and it it takes two seconds to be cool, as opposed to just being an asshole right out right, of the gate. Right, you know right. what I'm saying? So for me, it's 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 more important to show that fan that you actually care about what what they're saying. You know, so there's really nothing that that people can say to me. Right. You know? And mean, that's why Corey Taylor will be signing everything on June 30th oh, at the Mesa Amphitheater for the Stone Sour Show. Buttholes yeah. and everything. Yep, he's going to stay till <laughs> the very very end and sign everyone's butthole to the very end. Now, Josh, the very end. Rain it in, Josh. God damn, you're the you're always the, you're the calm one. I can't deal with this. Anymore. See, I appreciate what you said though he because very the, uh, I met Cheap Trick and Bunny Carlos wouldn't sign anything unless it was a drum head. Really? Yeah, and oh, and, and a guy finally said, who carries drum heads around? And he goes, yeah. and Bunny Carlos, staying in character the whole time, goes, well, then, I guess I got no reason to and be here. And he got <laughs> up and he left, and I'm like, awesome. brilliant. 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 Awesome, wow. Yeah, because he wouldn't sign anything unless it said cheap trick or was a drum. Wow. Has anybody ever really pissed you off that bad at a signing where you had to just walk away? No. no. I mean, I, I mean, you'd have to do I'm, some I'm pretty, pretty... I mean, contrary to popular belief, I'm pretty tolerant. But, right. I mean... Is that true, Josh? Yeah, <laughs> very quiet. Yes, when but, it comes yeah. to the fans, yeah. 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 <laughs> Has he ever lost it on you? I mean, you've known each other since you were twelve. No. Not really. Like best friends since you were twelve, like best buds. Well, BFFs? I mean, he was fifteen, I was sixteen, so oh. that's that's when we met. Awesome. And, uh, yeah, I mean, we've, we've been friends pretty much. It's a long time. friendship. We didn't have a real conversation though until we were. Like, yeah, like 20, 21. You guys probably collected garbage bail kids together, didn't you? No. I'm not comfortable answering that. <laughs> <counsel>. <laughs>
That's fine. That's fine. Speaking of that, I expect. Yeah, to yeah. We gotta need, have you need your own version. We gotta have Mashi Josh. Absolutely. Because this is this is wrong that he doesn't have one. Gory Corey, I'm gonna sign this Mashi to Josh. Joshy, I can see it in his eyes. Mashi really Josh sad. or just or Joshy? Do we want it to, Mar- to no? To Mashi rhyme? Josh. Mashi, Mashi Josh. Josh. It does, yeah. Okay, we can make that or work. Mosh and Josh and. Don't forget. Hydra Grey, June 30th, coming out. You can pre-order it today at Zia, 6 o'clock. They're going to be over there signing stuff. And then, of course, on the 30th, you got the Mason Meltdown. You're here in town. Right. It's going to be 197 degrees that day. Yeah, we're ready. It's a dry heat. It's a dry heat, so it'll be a <laughs> We're going to wear long sleeves and pants. Yeah, just have a couple of waters. You'll be fine. Anything you want to close things up with? Come on. Um, anybody. Oh, no, please. It, you've, like been, you've been doing such a great idea like this Gentlemen, whole time. Gentlemen, please, let me yeah. finish. Yes, if you would. <laughs> no, <it> was- Holmberg, <laughs> change the world. Josh, last words. Um, pick up the new record June 30th. Hydra grad, that's Hydra right. Hydra grad. Features number um, one single. After the Stone Sour signing's done, Corey, I guess... Now, so I'm gonna you'll put sign them, I'm gonna whatever you're yeah. yeah. sign. Whatever. I mean, I'm, I'm putting them on the glass, so I guess it better. Josh, have you ever signed a butthole or anything? Uh, absolutely like not. No, would you uh, <laughs> Would you not agree to that? Uh, I don't think so. Did you on, watch if it was for charity, that? you'd sign a butthole. Uh, no. <laughs> no. Not even for charity. <laughs> See, for like on, orphans or something. Those kids, they uh, need yeah, the your kids help. need buttholes. I, I, that that I love having Corey Taylor. It's the best. You're getting so many stupid calls, man. It's the best. killing me. It is just the best. Thanks for coming in, guys. Corey Taylor, Josh. Ran Stone Sour. You got the new album coming out June 30th. Hydrograd. Go pick it up. You can pre order it today at Zia. Six o'clock. They're going to be over there signing buttholes. Stop by. Bring your butthole. God damn it. Bring two. I don't know. You know. Two. Bring a dirty one. Bring a clean one. I don't care. He if does. You've got two. Show that off. <laughs> Make sure that you guys yeah. that's a wash free. one. Yeah, wash one. Bring it down. We'll, we'll, yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll sign it. Yeah, Thanks sure. for coming well, in, guys. Yeah, Mesa Amphitheater, yeah. the Mesa Meltdown, <laughs> June 30th. We love you. Stone Sour.